Hello and good morning, Tenerife Tears here around 10 o'clock in uh, Play Las Americas. I'm going to pan you around and show you where I am. Okay, we've got the H10 Las Palmeras over there. PJ's just sniding away at the back of the tree. May be able to see it shortly. I'm sure we will. Yep, there you go. Just the back of the tree. There we got the Tenerife Sol. Over there you're gonna get Leonardo's, Traveller's Rest, or Romantico. But uh, we're gonna have a walk up here today. One of those mini casinos there, and it's Santander. Bank. And uh, what do you think of these mini casinos? We would actually call them sports bars, I think. What do you reckon? Mama Rossa, just up there, which is a little bit of a restaurant, tucked away. Now, not eating in there. Uh, is it an hidden, hidden gem or not? And here's your uh, Little Italy. Just right at side of uh, Colon 2. And it looks like we've got a walkway and stuff to actually get into Colon 2 up there. Is it closed or is it just uh, communal access? Don't know. Certainly got a uh, ramp for disabled uh, wheelchairs, etc. etc. Yep, we'll have a quick walk in and have a look. Just looks like private apartments here, though, really, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it is. So, are these part of the uh, Cologne or not? That is the question. But, uh, we'll go back out. Yet it does actually say come on on the uh, the glass. Maybe this is half residential and half not. Oh, that's your Mama Rossa's uh, restaurant. Let's have a quick look at that. So, let's have a look at the menu. Sorry if it doesn't uh, do well on here. But, uh, the glass is a little bit steamed up. But it still looks affordable food, doesn't it? Let me know if you've eaten there. To back out again we go. Black and red. And same as I say, there are ramps available. Which is a good thing to see. Uh, more restaurants and what are these selling Italian once again plenty for everybody there isn't there so have you eaten here then folk I'll keep walking further spice of India as well Don't know if you can see that. Sure you can. You're not short of eating places along here though, are you? Another one of those mini casinos there as well. They seem to be all over, don't they? To, oh, and a pharmacy as well. And uh, restaurant Linares. Number four. Now, these have had all the floor tiled and such like in here, and they made a miraculous job. It's a beautiful place, one or two people actually eating in there, so I won't disturb them while we're actually uh, going up here as well. What do you think of that? Is that value for money? 
and your giddy goose open for breakfast from 9.30. Serves meetings until 10. You all right? So uh, there's the giddy goose. Enjoy. And uh, the martini just there. One or two of these little walkways around here. English rows, you make it out over there anyway. And uh, Algaria Barranco. Two key or two stars, whatever you want to wish. They're called these days, I don't know the difference, or are they both the same? Not a bad place to be, You've got a budget. And uh, the Irish Sports Bar below, which used to be the Anchor. Oh, just make it out at the top of the road on the right hand side, Las Paramedes. El Dorado there. So I'm sure you folk know exactly where I am. So have you stayed at any of these apartments then folk? Is it your favourite area? Or do you prefer to say somewhere different? Let me know your thoughts on that particular one. Meanwhile, I'm Tenerife Fez and I would like to thank you for watching and I will uh, see you in the next one.